Our last discussion presented an overview of what employees want from their supervisors and immediate managers. This time around, we're going to take a look at what employees want from their jobs. Because if they don't get what they want from their job, why would you expect them to give their best effort, especially in safety? Tiny Pulse, an employee engagement company, surveyed 200,000 employees from 500 organizations across the globe. They compiled a top 10 list of what employees want from their work. First, employees want camaraderie and peer motivation. They want to fit in because no employee wants to ever feel like an outsider in their own workplace. Second, employees want to have the intrinsic desire to do a good job. They really want to be allowed to do good work, not rushed work. Then, third, they want to feel encouraged and recognized. The fourth most cited response was that employees want to have a real impact, to feel that the work means something more than just a paycheck. They, of course, want to grow professionally, not necessarily to be promoted, but to at least improve their skill set. And in sixth place, employees really want to do the best for the customer. Then came money and benefits. Remember where this one finished, seventh. Employees then wanted to have a positive supervisor or manager, their first contact in the company. Ninth, your people really do want a reason to believe in the company. And summed up in the 10th place were all of the other answers. Interesting list, especially when you consider money finished in 7th place. But the top three were to fit in, to be recognized, especially by their peers, and to have permission to do a great job. Well, here's your takeaway and the key to building a better safety culture. Your employees want six other things more than they want money. That is, of course, assuming that you're already paying them fairly. Throwing more money at employees to make them perform better doesn't work. Oh, they'll take your money if you're not giving them the six things they want more than money. Money doesn't fix engagement and employee problems. Supervisors do. So supervisors and frontline safety people need the skills to encourage employees to be accepted by their peers, to do a good job, to be recognized, to feel like the job has meaning, to improve their skill set, and to do good for the customer. All of that comes ahead of money. If you're not giving your employees those top six items, they're not going to give you their best effort. That includes safety performance. You change your safety culture when you change the first six items on this list. For more strategies on how to improve participation in your safety culture, read all about the M4 method in my book, People Work, The Human Touch in Workplace Safety. Available online worldwide in paperback, Kindle, and audiobook. On Amazon, iTunes, and Audible.